That was the last yes. one of the uh, comic news. I turn the light on and I look, and it looks darker. I don't even know how that's. Oh, it looks good. Like, where you, yeah, you put your face to the face to the light, and not your back. I think. There we go. There we go. Nice. Yeah. Okay. So code eight. Mm-hmm. Code eight. Yeah, on Netflix. <laughs> like, oh, I haven't even watched that yet. Yeah, you're my, you're my um. Go tell me about it. Okay, so basically, it's 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 the Americans' version of a soft, soft version of My Hero Academia meets Training Day. Like it's bare soft in that sense. Like, <laughs> like it's really weird. Like so, basically, everybody. Um, I mean, most people have powers, like, you know, superhuman powers, da da da, da. But, um, and what is really smart, they, they don't hype it up to be like, oh, people are, you know, saving people, or, or there's no super, no superheroes. It's just they're people doing laugh. normal laugh. things, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, like, people who are good at electricity or uh, um, they have fire coming out of their hands, more of them are, like, manual skilled mm. workers. So, like, they, they're builders and stuff like that, da da And one of the main characters, like, he does electricity in his body, whatever, and he, he and he's, um, you know, that when they in America where they have the the people from Mexico and they stand in the, they stand in the line and then the truck comes right. and they're like, oh, I can do this, I can do that yeah. kind of thing. So he's oh yeah, yeah, guy. yeah. So he's one of those guys, um, which I thought was a really good idea because it's like um, society put them out mm. of work so that they could have machinery come in, kind of thing, and it was just like, rah, what would that, what would technology look like? putting people who have superpowers out of work oh, so that right. they put it in that which is which is smart yeah. kind of thing which is smart um so it's a story about him um and like he's got powers but they're not developed because his mum didn't want him to you know be limited so she kind of suppressed his powers or whatever da, 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 da. and you know he gets mixed up in the wrong crowd yada, 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 yada. characters are gonna heal there's a man I'm- who can Read your mind, um, <laughs> you know what I mean, kind of thing. There's a guy who's kind of bulletproof, yeah, all that, all that good stuff. Um, I think the only downside to the film, apart from it being budget, even though the special effects were not bad, mm. they were not bad. Um, it's just that, yeah, it just needed a bit more budget, right. like, and it needs to flesh out the story a little bit, kind of thing. Because, but it was, it's one of those ones where you're like, this is going to be trash, and then you're watching it, and you're like, okay, so it's. It's not trash, mm. you know. It's it's a small bit, but it's not trash, you know. There's there's good bits in there, like kind of thing. But it, uh, it's entertaining. It's entertaining. You know what I mean, don't you know? Don't expect it to be like a big big thing. But it's just, yeah, it's it's, it's, a, it's a good watch. It's a good watch. And this is on Netflix, right? Yeah, it's on Netflix. Yeah. 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 So you said film. Is it a film or a TV or a series? No, it's a film. Oh, I thought it was a series. I know. I think it was. I think it would have worked better as a TV show, because um, then yeah, they could have just done a lot more with it. But yeah. um, as yeah. a film, okay. But it's just like you should have maybe done a two part or, or <laughs> par, wow, two part <laughs> <laughs> or, <laughs> you know, or um, just had a longer film because I think it could have it could have really worked yeah. well if it was just a little bit longer kind of thing. Um, it was all right. It was a, yeah, three. Point five out, you know what I mean? No, it's not bad. Nice. It's not bad. All right. I'll put it on my list. So, it sounds good. Put it on your list, man. It's already on my list. Yeah. Already on my list. Get it on your list, people. Being on Get my it on my list. list. I saw Green Arrow and um, Flaming Head Guy from The Flash. I'm like, come on. I'm oh, see. In, yeah, a superhero, in a superhero show. Like, come on. Like, you ah. think I'm going to watch that? <laughs> FYI, little, little, little of. Uh, um, Trivia: The two actors. Did you notice they look alike? Oh, they're cousins. <gasps> Stephen Amell and Stephen Amell and the other Amell. <laughs> and the other Amell. The Ammels. Yeah, they're paternal cousins. And one of them was right. a character in season one of The Flash, and the other one was obviously Green Arrow. So nice. Oh. All right. Some Arrow. Could I giving you trivia out in these? Sh- oh, well, here we go. So I just know what I know. What I want to review. Oh, <laughs> I thought you wasn't going to review. <laughs> All right. Um, yeah. uh, I, I 
realized I realized I watched something because I've been catching up on the Flash, like last year's yeah. Flash. Go on then. <laughs> what are you saying? Right. So, but I'm not going to review last year's Flash because I want to know what happened with Nora. Now I know. Fun that. But I watched Supergirl episode eight of whatever season she's on. Mm-hmm. I really, 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 really cannot stand that <laughs> show. It is a horrible, horrible show. Oh my days. It's the worst. <laughs> what have we got? We've got Green Arrow, we've got The Flash, we've got Supergirl, and we've got Legends. Supergirl, not including Batwoman because it's new, and I haven't watched that yet. Yeah. Supergirl is the utmost worst TV show <laughs> ever. It sucks so much. What's a big animal? Buffalo. <laughs> buffalo bulls. It's buffalo bulls, man. This buffalo just laid its dick right in front of me and said, watch this for an hour. <laughs> but the reason I watched it, the reason I watched it is because it was part one. Mm-hmm. It was part one of Crisis on Infinite Earth. Oh, okay, all right. Okay. And, and as the first episode of the show that I am dying to watch, and I still can't watch the rest of it because episode nine of Batwoman doesn't start until like, like four weeks. <laughs> so I have four weeks before I can continue watching this. But man, episode one was shit. It was <laughs> shit. It was shit. Like, I'm, I'm wait, like, so I, so it was shit. <laughs> so um, Crisis is only coming on TV now, right? It's come. It's only coming on now. Uh, yeah. Well, basically, that episode of Supergirl aired weeks ago. Right. I don't know if they show flash and arrow yeah but i have to wait but because batwoman is on e4 not sky oh, one i have to okay. wait until e4, e4 shows it mm-hmm. then i'll watch right. it then i can go watch flash do all the other shows but episode one is a letdown the only things i liked was the beginning where it was showing you the <laughs> different the, no no, no, no. <laughs> well yeah it was this in the credits it was where it was showing you the different universe different universes so we got like Bert ward which i loved yeah. it Little chubby Burt Ward. He's not the skinny little kid he was. He's walking his dog, and he sees like something's happening to his earth. He's like, "Holy!" Do you know what I mean? He says that, and we've got like someone reading a newspaper, and then like the bat sign comes up, and then and then he looks up. This guy looks up. I don't know what character's supposed to be. He's like, "Man, I hope." This. He says, "It hey, wasn't that Wesley from Star Trek." That was Will Wheaton. Yeah. I saw Will Wheaton. I saw Will Wheaton in the credits, and I'm like, who was Will Wheaton? Yeah, so Will, Wheat- Will Wheaton's there just reading newspapers yeah. and looking at bat signs. That was yeah. dope. And well, they showed a couple of other universes that I just thought, this is sick. And But the rest of it, oh my days. <laughs> oh. I like the parts with the Flash. I like the parts with Green Arrow, White Canary. Oh, it was nice to see Ant Man. <laughs> Ant Man. At them, at them. Oh, wait, 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 wait a minute. At them. They play, he's been in Arrowverse, uh, Ant Man and Iron Man. Okay. They got DCs, but anyway, their stuff. Supergirl, like there was a scene where she, where she has to go send a, a message to Kal El, Superman, mm. and then Lois is like, "Kara, is that you? <gasps> and you're wearing pants." And it's like. The only reason she's wearing pants now is to be fucking what's the word? I'm uh, feminist. Enjoy, enjoy your show. Enjoy. <laughs> so that first episode was trash, and, and maybe yeah. maybe just you know watch the animated TV show and then skip to the second episode. What? The thing is. I like. I actually like the Supergirl character when she's in Flash or when she's in Arrow, but her TV show is horrible. Yeah, yeah it's, it's so it's, painful. It does get corny, man. It does get corny. Oh my! So I, I think I'm I glad like, that's over. That's I'm like, I'm, nope. sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm taking up a lot of time. I was just gonna say I'm glad that I've got that one out of the way. Yeah, I don't have to go now. It's done. Yeah. It's done. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well. <laughs> uh, I've been playing Final Fantasy 7 Remake um, That's pretty much what Ooh. I've been doing um, look at, look at. <laughs> No spoilers I mean, you, can you really get sp- spoiled from a game that's like 
20 that years old. I completed old. in like 1990 yeah. something, yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, oh, that is great. You stop off. It's, it's, it's a great film. Mm-hmm. It's a great um, game, man. It's really good. It's, um, mm-hmm. it's it, If you played it back in the days, it's kind of like... Um, it's obviously the same story, but it's kind of expanded because it's not. It, they kind of expand the characters a bit. They expand the story quite Ooh. much as well. And um, okay. yeah, it's it brings me back, man. It brings me back, and it's really it's it's a great game. Um, yeah, uh, kind of like the battle system is good. The um, character development, the music is has always been sick, but now you got like remix of the old school music as well and yeah it's it's a it's a dope game man i haven't i haven't stopped playing it since two weeks now i think yeah the game i'll do my work yeah yeah what character i really regret huh what's that I was like, what character are you playing? Just for, um, obviously for people who so don't know, like what character you got, uh, are you playing in it? There's, like, uh, there's loads of, yeah, it's a yeah. team, it's a kind of team game. So I'm playing with uh, Cloud, Barrett and Tifa mm-hmm. at the moment. Um, mm-hmm. Yeah, there's, they've got different kind of <laughs> ways of fighting and you can, you know, use power-ups and... Uh, get them different techniques as well. You get them different weapons that have different. This guy. <laughs> I'm just gonna steal his review. He's doing it wrong. So you got Cloud Strike, yeah. twenty-one-year-old mercenary, <laughs> who comes back to Midgar all dishevelled and confused, and then his best friend Tifa Lock Tifa Lockhart from his hometown of Nibelheim finds him at the train station, takes him back to their hideout, which is Avalanche, and a bar called Seventh Heaven <laughs> in the Sector 7 slums. That's basically like a, a ghetto. Brixton, Brixton <laughs> or Air Peckham or something. <laughs> and then Barrett is the leader of the um, of Avalanche, and they go out and they want to go fuck up a reactor in Sector 6? Is that like six, Croydon? Sector 6. <laughs> yeah, that's like Croydon. So they yeah. brought up the reactor, and then, and then, and then Cloud's part it's of the team, sick. and it is dope. And so Cloud has, big, Cloud has this big ass sword. Like you don't know how he lifts it. He calls it the Buster Sword, and it's got these little two slots in it to put material <laughs> in. I'll tell you about material another day. Then Tifa, Tifa is like a master martial artist, so she's all like, wah, wah, wah. and then but she's also super super strong. Then Barrett is like this big muscly hench black dude, mm-hmm. and of he lost his he lost his arm. You have to play the game to find out how he lost his arm. But he's also got a gun arm now, so he puts these attachments on. He's like, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> And yeah. then, yeah, that's the team. There's more characters as well, yeah. but that's what Richard has yeah. at the moment. But he wasn't doing yeah, that's, justice. You did, I thought you I would did take it over. Perfectly. A lot better than I could have ever done it, man. My enthusiasm right now is just down here. I love, so. I love it. It's like... <laughs> Rich's one was like the jazz hour. Yeah. He's got like his scotch. He's like so basically, you know. This, this. And then like <laughs> like Kieran, who's on like enemy, like the rock channel. Like this is what's happening. Yeah, the, pretty much what Kerry was saying is is pretty oh. much that. Um, it's dope, man. It is dope. And just getting to know the characters and knowing their history and going through their the story. Uh, mm-hmm. It's 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 yeah. It's dope. It's dope. Definitely recommend it. I have a question. Actually, this question is very soon for my brother, but you're here now. Okay. Did you yeah, did, yeah. did you ever watch Advent Children? So you know how Cloud they portrayed him to be this very depressing kind depressing. of character in that movie. He's not. And really, then I don't this, know if you played like, the difference with this and the old school one is like obviously because you got voice actors in this now, so you kind of know what, how they're saying stuff yeah. rather than reading it yourself and kind of trying to. Yeah. Um, but yeah, he's he's not dep- he he is he's, he he's not depressed. Depressed. He's just not a bullshit. Huh? He's like, look, I'm here to get paid. He's basically Fair a mercenary, enough. mercenary, yeah. a a, hi- a gun for hire, basically. Yeah. And at the beginning, he just he just wants. He's only there to get paid. And he's like, dude, don't tell me about this because the av- yeah. avalanche they 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 blown up the reactor because it's kind of like oil in a sense where um, they're digging up the, the earth. Uh, and they're damaging the earth um, and Av- Avalanche is like the uh, protesters kind of t- terrorist group who wants to save the earth extreme protesters extreme protesters um, <laughs> you say green party <laughs> a lot worse than green party um, 
they so yeah. they're going out to blow up the reactor because they want to basically save the earth um mm-hmm. but certain mad things happens between between that but on their journey cloud is just like barrett is trying to tell him what trying to describe what's happening like they're c- cleaning out the earth man you can feel the earth crying mm-hmm. it's like dude just shut up i just want to get paid man so it's it, his character yeah. in that way is, is sick and even barrett's character like actually having like the voice actors for this is they picked the perfect people definitely per- the perfect people the, re- the reason i ask is because so i know you didn't play uh, the kingdom hearts games or even um did you yeah, play Final yeah. Fantasy Dissidia? With yeah. like all the main Final Fantasy characters. So Cloud, since having children, was always portrayed to be this oh like overly nonchalant yeah. and overly depressed, yeah. if that makes sense, since having children. But even even without the voice acting. You can get it. Yeah. Even without the voice acting, he was he wasn't yeah. that depressing. He was cold mm-hmm. and he did come across like he wanted his money, but there was there were points where he he, he well that's kind of lightened the, up in, in, the, in game, the game. There is a sense. point where he lightens up, and if you really think about what what if you played the game, yeah. the, the old game, and you kind of know what I'm talking about, like at that point he has to lighten up, and then from that point he's kind of like yeah, you kind of yeah. Even even when you're playing it, you're like, oh man, I can't believe you're doing this. But you're saying that to the character, but you're playing the yeah. character, so you're but actually doing it as well. You're doing you're it yourself. Yeah. No, I was just so wondering it's, if it's quite if, bad. I was just wondering if 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 they if if they decided to keep on with this depressing yeah. version of him, or if they because basically because I never really saw Cloud as that depressing. It's only since mm-hmm. Advent Children, every after every other portrayal after that, Kingdom Hearts, Kingdom Hearts Two. Uh, Final Fantasy the Cedar, he was yeah. always just this depressing no, I, uh, kind of guy he, but in a, yeah, his no, original he's, character he's, wasn't like that yeah he's, yeah, no, he's, 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 he's a soldier that's basically he's, he's a he's a he's a uh, he's a yeah. soldier so he's he's not depressing he's just he's he's there to do a job he wants to get get in do his job get paid and go basically so yeah he, he's not up for that shit chat yeah <laughs> anybody who drive comes from go play the final fantasy 7 remake because i mean you pray can't now because i've been trying to get it sold out my one regret in this whole stupid quarantine is that i didn't buy it when i had the chance because i thought uh oh wait can you not download it then i can i can but hypothetically hypothetically if i drop a glass of water on my ps3 <laughs> for a ps4 that's it doesn't happen touch with that's it but if i have the hard copy if i have the disc (laughs) yeah i'm not sure if that's i think you can i'm not 100 percent sure to be honest myself if you can do that rich i I need the disc i need to open the case i need to smell that new fresh game smell (laughs) yeah have you don't get that from have you tried the the hookup for the the Uh, amazon amazon's got it amazon's selling it oh there you go so amazon Amazon doesn't have it. They're sold out. But then Amazon, who is selling it? Oh, right, for okay. slightly higher. I refuse. Okay. I refuse. And I checked no, eBay. I don't buy it people, eBay. you know, I I, oh, it, people get on my no, 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 I'm not. I'm not. I was just checking just to, just to see. And some son of a bitch, and he probably got them off Amazon. <laughs> so that's one of my copies. I still got the still got a picture on my phone because a screenshot. He has. Did I delete it? <laughs> This son of a bitch. CEX. You never know. That might be like a random game. CEX. CEX. They ain't open. It's a quarantine. Yeah, but they might be still doing deliveries. They might do CEX deliveries. delivers. I mean, they might do deliveries. Everybody has to adapt nowadays. You know. What Anyways, I mean? I'll <laughs> consider that. But getting to my point, some son of a bitch on eBay had like going from memory of the picture one, two, three, four, six, Oops. twelve, twelve copies. Wow. Wow. 12 copies of Final Fantasy 7 and they're trying to sell it for more yeah. than the Arsenal. Yeah, that, that's liberties, man. I hate that. Resellers, yeah. man. Yeah. 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 Damn you. Wow. Oh, dear. But, you know, um, try, I'll, I've it, got a right? website for you. You can try. Um, they might have it in stock. Um, Shop2.net. See? I'm your pusher. Shop2.net. Uh, uh, two. Uh, two. <laughs> I'm your Number push. Two. See, look, 
If you ever need anything here, Rich is the man to go to. That's why he's na- that's why he's that's why he's called We Read Comics Two. Yeah, because he does all the other stuff as well. Indeed. But he reads comics too. <laughs> so if you need, yeah, you need Rich. Yeah, go to Rich. Okay. Website like a bright house. No, though. they're good. They're good. Man. They do look like bright house though. But no, they they. But they are. Cheap. It looks the cheapest, like bright house. Um, place that I know anyway. 